right, folks, we have 305 Golf, 305 G, and HDT Basex shelters, 305 Stovepipe Tent. You want proof? There's your stovepipe port right up there. These tents have three windows on each side and two doors. So that's four doors, six windows. On the ends, we can be open like it is here or with the end walls, like you see hanging off the end of this one, that'll have a door in the middle. We even have one that has a garage door. We're gonna sell that one separately, I think. So this one, everything we've already been through changed out a part or two. So structurally, everything is sound. All of the brace wires and crossing wires are good. And uh, we may have replaced one or two on that. Inside, the Velcro has pulled off uh, that holds the windows up, which is typical in these tents. They all have a clear window, a screen window, and an opaque window. So that's one that's pulled loose. Usually if one pulls loose, all of them do. Two, three, four, five. Yeah, it looks like all six of them, the Velcro has pulled loose. There's our stovepipe port and the roof actually looks pretty good. I see one little pinhole up here that you might want to put a patch on. So the repair kits uh, use just a little vinyl patch and the, the, the uh, glue that you hold the patch on looks like it, the product is called shoe goo so you can use that to patch these all right so this one if you're looking for one so we've got a couple little abrasions here that actually looks like the forklift operator may have poked through that a couple little scrapes and scratches here and there overall pretty decent not pristine oh there's a 203 end wall for one of those smaller model tents over there. We, we got some smaller ones too. These uh, 305s are 18 feet wide, 25 feet long. So these are the big mamma jammas. That's a 303 sitting over there. That's 18 by 15. That one, the 203, is 15 by 14. So that's the two series is, is the 14 wide. And then, you know, there it is up. There it is down. We're, we're lowering them so they can dry, but then they're easy for a couple people to put them away. So anyhow, there you have it. If you're interested in this tent, please let me know. Maybe you need a carport. Maybe you need a place to work on your Humvee. Or heck, I don't know. I don't think a deuce and a half would fit in here. I don't think it's tall enough. I was gonna say, or your deuce and a half. I, I think that'd be a bad idea, but who knows. Here we go. We're calling this one 305 Golf. If you want to take golf home, let me know. Tent at gearreport.com or you can go to the Gear Report website, gear-report.com. In the search blank, type HDT Tent and that'll take you to the HDT Basex Tents for Sale page and you may see golf listed or not. If you don't see it listed, but you're interested in one that's open on each end, shoot me a note, tent at gearreport.com. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments. A big thanks to our patrons for helping us bring you more unbiased, hands-on reviews. Thank you very much, and we'll see you at the range.